Hello, I'm Superintendent Anthony Godfrey. Jordan School District employees have been working very hard to prepare to welcome students back to school in the fall. But we also want families to have options. One of those options is for students to learn virtually from home with the daily help of a teacher. Students who enroll in this program will still be registered at their school, but will be able to learn from home. We've handpicked a number of teachers for every grade level from throughout Jordan School District to create high quality content in every grade level and every core subject. We encourage you to watch this video to learn more about this unique program that will allow parents a choice to allow their students to learn from home. If you choose to enroll in this program, you can do so through the month of January, at which time you can reevaluate your family's needs. Thank you for being part of the Jordan School District community, and we look forward to seeing you and having a great experience with your student this fall. We have changed the mindsets of people on how to deliver instruction to students. The biggest change is that we've realized that students can learn in different environments. Different environments like in a virtual classroom, online, at home, but still part of Jordan School District. This fall, this, our at-home model is completely different. This isn't emergency learning. This is prepared, planned out, teacher-created, teacher-driven, students in mind, curriculum that has been designed specifically for students. Jordan District teachers using Jordan District programs, using Jor Jordan District evidence-based practices that we know are best and are best for students, those are the teachers that have created this curriculum. Yeah. It's designed for people who teach in our schools that are interacting with our students, interacting with our population. They know what they need. So perhaps you have visited one of Utah's national parks. We've got five. It's all based on the Utah standards. It's all, everything we do is tied back to the standards, each lesson, all 180 days of them. And with the curriculum created for Jordan by Jordan educators, students will not be alone to navigate learning. The cool thing about this is we're not doing just do it on your own. This is something where every day students are gonna have live instruction from their teacher. This is specifically designed to be teacher-driven instruction. Fourth grade teacher Amy Anderson helped create the curriculum. It's a great curriculum and for me as a teacher going back into the classroom I feel more prepared. Whether I have to um, go back online or if I have a student that's sick I can follow that curriculum. That was one thing that I probably learned from the um, spring experience and that was how important the students need to see their teacher daily. Larissa Coe is a full-time online teacher in Jordan School District. She also helped to develop the year's worth of online curriculum for students. I think the biggest myth is that students and teachers can't have a relationship if they don't meet in person. Um, and teaching full-time online, I have no students in a classroom. I don't even have a classroom. Uh, but I do have students that I really care about and I know them and I've seen them grow over the course of uh, taking my courses. Online teaching is kind of cool in the fact that it's very one-on-one. -on -one. Um, instead of just addressing the loudest kid in the room, you get to really get to know each individual student. What we've found out most of all is that teachers matter more than ever in an online setting. That the support that they give to the students uh, is more, not less and so that uh, there isn't a button on a computer that you can push and say, do it for me. The teacher has to do a lot of interaction with students, a lot of feedback, uh, more not less is what the teacher's job is going to be in this online setting. Again, the Jordan Virtual Online Curriculum will involve daily interaction with teachers. In this segment of the video, I want you to pause and reflect on the question that you're seeing on the screen. This isn't something that a kid gets on and does other does at random times of the night. Now what will happen though, is the teacher's gonna provide a live lesson. Let's say a student misses, they, 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 they miss that time window. You know, maybe they had a doctor's appointment, maybe they're sick, maybe they needed to sleep in. That's great, like, we wanna provide that accommodation. So what that teacher will do, they'll provide that lesson, then they'll record it, and they'll put that back up there. And so the student will be able to go in and still listen to that live instruction every day, and then the teacher's gonna have opportunities to respond and be able to provide feedback to the students. I think parents went through a really hard time with the transition, just like all of us did. Um, but I think that what parents need to know is that uh, the teachers really care about their students and they will do anything to help them learn. 
We love our students. I'm excited about it. This is something that's, you know, it's a game changer. It's an opportunity for education to provide students in lots of different environments, wherever they're at, to be able to have high quality instruction, you know, and just, just to stay part of the Jordan family and part of what we're doing and being here with teachers. Again, thank you for being part of the Jordan School District community. We wish you and your families well, and we look forward to serving you in the fall.